in a world where peace once reigned. An insidious infection has turned everything into chaos. The undead now roam freely, consuming everything in their path. You must kill them and clean the world from the infection. Engage in epic battles against relentless hordes. Join alliances and strategize with friends. Build and protect your city from threats and unlock powerful heroes. Age of Origins. Hey guys, welcome back. As always, my intention here is to show you some of the crazy stuff I like to do in Age of Origins. Today, I'm going to share something interesting with you. I decided to save up all my fuel and use it during one of the themed events. Now, if you're unfamiliar with themed events, let me explain. Every month, Age of Origins introduces a new event. For example, the current event event is the Sea Conquest, and last month we had the Beach event. The way it works is that when you kill zombies in the world, they drop a special event currency, like anchors, in this case, or other items, depending on the theme. You can collect these and trade them for free rewards. But here's a heads up. Don't expect too much from the zombies themselves. The drop rate for these items is extremely low. However, I still believe it's worth it way better than using your fuel elsewhere. So, what did I do? I used around 300 small gas units, which is fuel, and about 70 or 71 of the larger ones. By the second day, I had collected 215 event items. Actually, it's probably a little less, because sometimes you buy 10 or 5 of these items in exchange for resources. And this is of course the paid version and this is Helm. You buy it and it is literally like any other sea. Why did I choose to actually save up my fuel? Because if I got this anchor or a special item, there is a chance I'm getting extra items here and even more XP. What I used to do is equip XP into my officer to increase the XP, which again made me rank 1 in XP level. If I went into my nation ranking and saw the commander level here. Even though I'm not really big base compared to the rest, I'm level 31 and I'm even higher than this guy who's level 28. I'm always hitting level 32 while another guy, for example, is like a fat whale at 28. So I even surpassed this guy. Look, I'm almost 32 too. Let me show you how much or basically what I'm going to get and why exactly I decided to use it here again. I'm saying this because it matters to me the XP look, let us watch how much I'm going to get. For example, five minutes is something you don't want to gather. I don't like it, no. I want to use them one by one. See resources. I don't like one hour. I'm only going to comment if there's something decent, but so far there's nothing. One hour again. Okay, C5. That's what I wanted to show you. I think once I get all of it, C5000 XP. That's 5000 XP, which is why I wanted to save all my fuel for this event, because it gives me a lot of XP. This is why I literally saved it not for the resources or speed ups, but for that massive 5000 XP. It's really a lot. And it's much better than level 30. If you paid attention here, I'm going to show you when I attack a monster, how much the monastery gives me. A level 28 with an extra X. P gives me 1,600. And even a level 30 with a higher rank might give me 2,000. But with this one, I'm getting all the swipes out. Let me now use all three that I managed to collect. Which, by the way, took me so much time to save over a month. But I think it's going to be worth it. I'll be able to get some free items and at least lop my commander XP thanks to the amount of fuel I've saved. Now, let me use all of these and then I'll try. So I got 430 points completely free like. I didn't even use the purple helm for this. 
the 400 points will allow me to exchange for the second item though the third one is blocked because of course you need money for that but now I have enough to switch whether you're a free-to-play player or not your objective is simply to get the item that's really hard to obtain unless you buy something like the Titan equipment there's no easy way to get it for free for free to play you can get warplane parts but it's usually a weekly thing if I were pushing I'd definitely go for warplane parts or anything related to warp parts and Titan I'm going to buy all of those but do you see because of my patience I was able to get 15 of one item and a couple of others completely free today without buying any bundles as for the bundles or purple items this is the second day I can use this and show you but it doesn't give commander XP now let's see how much those 200 actually gave me oh my god that's not bad it gave me 44 multiplied by 5,000 which is going to push me to level 32 at this stage I'm level 32 and I think in the nation I should be globally competing even with whales like model and rank 11 by the way my base is only level 23 so I'm not particularly persistent but I'm nowhere near good in the global ranking Let's check the global level for the commander. It's not updated, but do you see how crazy it is? I think I'm going to push to second and potentially beat this whale, which likely has 6 million power compared to my 2 million. Yet I managed to overcome and get extra development, which I absolutely love. I can use it to get more materials or mobility, whatever I want. Seriously, it is so worth it. So that's what free to play looks like for you after saving up for over a month. This is all my fuel. And if you don't believe me, you can never earn this anchor unless you're hitting zombies. That's it, the drop is from zombies. You can see this is my score without using a single campus. Now, if I use the compass, it's going to be a different story. But again, does he figure? Oh yeah, I forgot to show you something. Alongside the zombies I fought, I think I managed to get a lot of recruitment. Of course, it might be a bit less than this, but yeah, I'm still freaking happy. Let's see. It did not give me any XP. So gup all your fuel. Once you save up all your fuel, you can literally use it during these events because they give you more Commander XP. In conclusion, saving up your fuel is a strategic move that can significantly enhance your gameplay. By participating in events and attacking zombies, you can earn valuable rewards, including Commander XP and recruitment opportunities. Thank you for watching.